Hi, it's Jacqueline here, and this is going to be my January slash wrap up slash book haul. So, in the month of January, I have required 10 books and read 5 books. So, doing pretty good with the reading because my good, good read challenge of the year is to read 100 books before 2018. So, hopefully, I'll get it. So, let's get started with the video. Okay, the first book I received received slash bought was Nerve by Jenna Ryan and this is the movie tie-in edition go see the movie great movie next I received is also the is also a movie that's come out so go see the movie or read the book either way great is Duff by Kobe Capper Capler Inc. If you read the book, you know how to pronounce it, so please don't make fun of me. I, I'm not good with the reading of names. Book reading, I'm good at, just not reading with names. I'm sorry. Kobe Kepler. Duff. Next book is Witch or Wizard by James Patterson and Gabriella Cart Bonnet. Infernal by Shirley Kent. Sh Sherlyn Kennett and this is the fourth book in the Chronicles of Nyx series uh, and this is the fifth book Illusion also by Shirley Shirley Kepernick I'm not even going to try anymore guys I'm sorry and this is the fifth book next and Steel Heart by Brandon by Brandon's Sand Sanderson, Steel Heart. <gasps> Look how pretty this cover is. I like it. Okay, and then Halo by Alexander Alberto. I'm sorry. Okay, and two books. Uh, these two, these two next books I required from my English teacher, and that is Anna and the King of Cy 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 Cylon. And this is actually the book that inspired the musical play and film, The King and I. So, yeah. And the next book is Guinevere, The Queen of Summer Country by Rosalind Miles. And the last book that I bought in the month of January is Heartless by Melissa Meyer. That's, yeah. <laughs> okay. And we all know how pretty this cover is. And when it's naked too, guys, look at this. Look at this. Look how pretty. I mean, oh, oh, look how, oh, look how pretty, guys. I'm just, yes, beautiful. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Beautiful. I love it. Yeah. And now the books I've read this month. The first book that I read this month was, <laughs> sorry, was Nerd. And I give this a three out of five stars. Because it took me a long time to get into it. I mean, very long. I mean, like, for the first hundred pages, I was kind of kind of confused a little bit. Uh, and then towards the end, it was got it got good, but then it ended, so what can you do? Next book I read was The Duff. And this book, so, like, the first three chapters, I kind of had to push myself to get in because it wasn't really timey in them around the first 50 pages I started getting really into it and let me tell you something this is way different than the movie I mean phew, don't even get if you read the book and seen the movie you know what I'm talking about it's just like where well, I didn't know about that until like I read it and I'm not gonna spoil cuz I don't like when people spoil okay and I'll let you know if I'm gonna spoil beforehand so next book I read so the next three books I read were rereading so I've already read these but I decided to, you know what reread them and the first book was life and death by Stephanie Meyer <laughs> and this is the 10 year anniversary edition of Twilight and basically it's Twilight but with the all the characters reversed in gender and I actually like this book maybe better than Twilight Secret. So, what can you say? I give this five out of stars on Goodread. 
Next book I next book I read of the month of January is City of Bones by Cassandra Clare. Oh, and of course, gave this five out of five stars. I mean, who does not love the Mortal Instruments? I mean, they're just wonderful books. Everything Cassandra Clare writes is just oh, makes you just want to be a shower hunter, doesn't it? I know I do. Next book is City of Ashes, also by Cassandra Clare. And as you can see, I'm still, I have like a hundred or so pages left to go in this book. But I'm still counting it because I'm going to read it before February. So, and can I, so I know, no, this isn't part of it. But look at this cute bookmark I got. It's Tessa, guys. And look at this cute quote. I love it, okay? Came all the way from Australia. So, yeah. I, I love it, okay? I really do. And well, that's it for now. That's it. So, thank you. Like this video and please subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.